Tunisia's Prime Minister, Mohamed Ghannouchi, a holdover from the regime toppled last month, had to resign after a weekend of violent protesters left five people dead. One of the victims was Hamdi Bahri, a 17 years old boy from the capital, Tunis. Hamdi's mother spoke to Press TV about her son. My son had a job for two years. He was coming home from work when they shot him in the chest on the Kotraj Avenue. There was renewed violence on Monday, after which two more ministers resigned. Like Hanoushi, they had both previously served as ministers under President Ben Ali's regime. There were industry minister Afif Shalbi and international cooperation minister Mohamed Nouri Jwini. Another victim was Anis Jlasi, a 28 years old father of three. He was shot dead in the back. We don't know who killed my son. I hope someone will step forward and give us some information about the events that led to his death. It isn't clear if the resignations will appease the demands of the various protesters. The ongoing protests in central Tunis could be an indication that the nation wants more. Tunisia has been unsettled since the revolution that ousted President Zel Abedin Ben Ali, an event that became a catalyst for upheavals in neighboring Arab countries. Wasim Ben Arhuma, Press TV. Tschüss.